right, welcome to today's smoke break, everybody. Thank you, thank you. What we have today, we've got a double header, first of all, but this is our first break in the double header. This is 2024 Onyx Vintage. That's these two boxes right here. You can't really see both of them on uh, on Instagram, but they're both there. And we have an autographed baseball from Onyx Preferred Players. Lots of good names on that checklist for sure. The other the other boxes, these two boxes, a little bit less, I guess, uh, knowledge of what we're going to get because they just didn't release a full checklist. But what we have is, first off, we'll start off with this one. This is the base series. Five cards per pack, 24 packs. Four autographs, five parallels. We also have the mega series box. 10 cards per pack, only 10 packs, six autos, and four parallels in this box. So that's the two boxes of cards we have. We've got our baseball, and we've got our 420 giveaway. Plus, I have a mystery bonus box that I'm going to do also. So, all right, that'll do it. Let's get to it. Let's put a little bit more smoke on this box real quick, and let's get to breaking it. All right, all right. This is the first break <coughs> back from vacation. So I wanted to make it a big one. I wanted to do a double header. But because this Onyx is just, there's so much. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> there's so much unknown about it. I don't blame it for having a hard time selling out. But that's okay because uh, that just means more spots for me. All right, let's put this out. I actually do like Onyx. I think it's a, a pretty decent, pretty decent set. The price this year for 2024 is definitely not consistent with what it has been in the past, but um, that can be attributed to the fact that they have these big boxes now. Before it was always small boxes. I mean, like literally tiny little boxes. I wish I had an example, but like if you've ever done, oh, here we go. Like Tops Rip, this is usually the size of box that um, Onyx would come in, is stuff like that, like a box that size or so. So they've definitely uh, expanded, and uh, I guess the price will will reflect that. So all right, here we go. We're going to start off with the base series. Like I said, four autographs in this box and five parallels. The one thing that I will say about this right off the bat is that I don't like the fact that this is not really cellophane wrapped or, or whatever you want to call it. Maybe not cellophane, but it's not shrink wrapped. Like, look at this. This is open. This is the only sticker right here that's keeping this thing closed. I just opened. So I got to say, I'm not really a fan of that. When you talk about sealed boxes, I usually think that you would expect a little bit more than one tiny little sticker. So here's our packs. They're all mixed up. They're... <laughs> They're sideways, they're everything, so I gotta tell you, right off the bat, this is not leaving a great impression on me. I mean, we'll see how the cards come out, see the quality of them. I actually, like I said, I like the the way that Onyx does, I like the card stock they use. But, yeah, I don't know, this is a, it's different. It's different. It looks like each of these packs is like like a retail pack or almost like a, a mini hanger pack. And there's a ton of room left over in the pack. You see that? This is all just like wasted space. So lots of chance for movement in the pack. I don't know. Let's open some up and see how they look. See how they are. But this is, uh, like I said, not impressing me straight off the bat. All right, but off the bat, I do see we have a parallel. Perhaps an autograph, too. We'll see. All right, Carson Williams. There's a name you might recognize for Tampa Bay. Trevor McDonald for San Francisco. There's also image variations in here. 
And see that one right there? Out of 99, but what out of 99? It just says out of 99. It's not like individually numbered. It just says out of 99. So there's Trevor McDonald. There's one of the big names I said, Leo DeVries. And yes, he was for San Diego. I'm glad I remembered that. So that's pretty nice. Sammy Basayo, another name that you probably recognize from Baltimore. Matt Ager, prospect. There will be a lot of prospects in here. That's for sure. Let's maybe open it from the bottom, see if that maybe goes a little better. All right, another parallel. Wahiwa Aloy, first off as a prospect. Chase Burns, a prospect. This one should be out of 99 as well, yep. I don't know exactly if this is just blue or they call it baby blue or what. But Chase Burns. Another Leo DeVries. Here's the back kind of plain if I'm if I'm honest all right now here we see uh, a nice example of te <coughs> a terribly centered card <coughs> over here on the left hand side there's basically no space over here on the right side lots of space Drew Burns and here's a duel Corbin Carroll Tommy Troy that's not bad it's not terrible I don't know about these pictures they choose, though. I mean, I've seen pictures of Corbin Carroll. I've seen video. I've seen games that he's played in. And that doesn't look like Corbin Carroll to me. So, all right, here we go. Got a yellow this time or maybe a gold. Brody Brecht, prospect. Trevor Werner for KC. And here, this one's miscut on the other side this time. So let's see. This one is out of 150. And again, the quality is not there this year. From what I've seen in the past, much better. It's been much better in the past. This is not impressive. There's Jason Churio for Cleveland. Caden Dana. And Dylan Lesko, another big name for San Diego. San Diego and the Chicago Cubs were kind of, kind of the sleepers in this uh, set, as far as I could tell. As far as prospects go, I don't know a ton about other teams, except for the big names, but I do know the Dodgers. I do know the Dodgers' uh, pipeline a little bit. Okay, no auto in here. Let's go ahead and save that parallel for the end. Jacob Cozart. There's Freddie Freeman. There's the biggest arguably the biggest name in the set reggie crawford robbie snelling another san diego player and travis sakura for washington out of 150 again no number just out of 150 i have seen some of these that are numbered like hand numbered i've also seen some that are um like stamped numbered and I've also seen ones like these that have no number at all. So kind of disappointing as far as quality control goes. There's Jackson Churio this time. Nice. Got both Churio brothers so far. Caleb Lomavita. Trevor McDonald. Yoshinobu Yamamoto. Very cool. Like that one. And Jefferson Caro for Milwaukee. Should be out of 150. It is. So, okay. After four or five packs, whatever it's been, I think I'm I'm just about ready to render my judgment. Maybe I'll wait until we get a, an autograph. Tristan Peters. Drew Burris. Harry Ford for Seattle. There's another duel. Be nice to get a duel auto. Blake Mitchell and, Gre and Rhett Louder. Very cool. And Luke Stevenson, prospect. I've heard that name before, too. Don't know who he's uh, affiliate affiliated with or if he is. 
I mean, it doesn't have his college on it, so I'm guessing he's with some team. Brock Wilkin, we got a dual, dual uh, parallel. Jason and Jackson Churio, that's a nice one. Should be out of 150. Yep. Blank out of 150. Drew Thorpe, Jorge Marcheco, and Rhett Louder, and again with the miscutting. Look at that. That's terrible on the bottom. That is terrible. Man, I, I've really not had anything negative to say about, about this company, about Onyx. I've opened, um, I don't know, probably three or four, maybe five different years of stuff. They have vintage. They have vintage extended. Uh, what else? They had some other stuff before in previous years. And uh, I had no, no complaint about it, but the quality control on these is... Not as good as I would like. I'll just say that. Alfred Duno out of 150 for Cincinnati. Jefferson Caro, Jace La, La Violette, and Kobe Mayo, another name that you've probably seen or heard before. But no autographs yet. This is the, the base box. Only five cards per pack and... Uh, 24 packs, so a lot. JoJo Jackson, I believe that's a, a pretty big name too, as far as prospects go. Jacob Cozart, Nick Frosso, Freddie Freeman again. And another duel, Matt Shaw and Cade Horton. The duels are they're kind of cool. I've seen the, the dual autos on eBay, and the dual autos, those are pretty nice. Okay, Ethan Holiday. <clears throat> There's a big name prospect. I think he's only like 17 right now, Ethan Holiday. We got a blue Trevor Werner for KC out of 99, not numbered out of 99. Jason Churio, Caden Dana, and Dylan Lesko. A lot of, uh, again, since we don't have a full checklist. It's hard to kind of say, like, are we seeing a lot of doubles? Or is this normal because it's a very small set? I mean, I don't know. It's hard to tell. And, uh, yeah, that's just the way it is. So, Chase Burns prospect. Drew Thorpe for San Diego. Kobe Mayo again. Jet Williams. we got no parallel, so are we going to see an autograph finally? Not yet. Blake Mitchell, Jet Williams, Kobe Mayo. A couple decent names. But no auto yet. Should be four autographs in these packs. I've also seen boxes where uh, there's more than four. So we'll hope for that. Kaner Delgado. There's a nice San Diego duel. Drew Thorpe and Robbie Snelling. Out of 150. Yep. Wow, Slovakia just scored against England in... Uh, in my game. And again, look at that miscut just terribly. Jefferson Caro, Caden Dana, and Chase Burns. Man. Really disappointing. Like I said, I've never had any complaints with this product until today. Matt Shaw, Cade Horton duel. Jet Williams gold or yellow. I want to call it gold, but it's more like a a mustard yellow, a deli mustard yellow or something. 150. Jefferson Caro, Jace LaViolette, and Kobe Mayo. It's like the third Kobe Mayo card. So not only are we getting doubles, we're getting triples. And that's uh it's not fun. A small set I get, but if they if they have a small set, they should oh there's River Ryan. It's a Dodgers prospect. Nice pitching prospect. But yeah, if they uh, if they have a small set, cool. But they should keep them in those little boxes and have have them be smaller, cheaper. But I don't know. This is not impressing me so far. River Ryan, there's our first autograph. Trevor McDonald for San Francisco. San Francisco, that's me. So Trevor McDonald. We got Zach Cole, 
Wickelman Gonzalez and Jason Churio. There's a couple new names at least. Well, at least this one, it's got the autograph. At least it's much closer to being centered. Base auto, no number. But there's a couple people on uh, on Reddit that are San Francisco Giants fans. So maybe, just maybe, I got a little little trade action coming up. We'll see. Got to do some research on Trevor McDonald. I think I've heard that name before. <clears throat> Mason Montgomery. There's a oh, there's a nice one for San Diego. Drew Thorpe. Like I said, uh, San Diego's kind of the sleeper, one of the sleepers in this set. Several good uh, good players. Drew Thorpe being one of them. <clears throat> San Diego. Who got San Diego? Oh, that's also me. One of the benefits of not selling out a break is that more cards for yourself. Not bad. Good to see. At least the autos are much better centered. And they're on-card autos. So that's a positive. Trevor Werner, Sammy Basayo, and another Yamamoto. Like that. All right, we're well over halfway done with the box, so we've probably got about eight more packs, maybe eight or nine more packs, I'm guessing, without counting them. And still two more autographs to come. Chase Burns, another autograph, back to back to back. Bryce Rayner, prospect. Bryce Rayner. I saw that name, Rayner, and it reminds me of uh, Rainier Washington. So that'd be kind of cool if he was coming up in the Seattle system. Because I know Rainier, I believe, I believe Rainier has a minor league team. Jackson Churio, Nick Frosso, and Wahiwa Aloy. So interesting... Interesting set, but I got to tell you, for the quality that I've seen so far and having the parallels being unnumbered, uh, which was normal in the past, but they have them stamped this year. I don't know why they don't stamp the individual number, but um, not impressed, I got to admit. Matt Shaw, Matt Ager. So I guess they just uh, pack all the autographs back to back to back. That's another prospect, Matt Ager. And that should be our four autographs. So anything after this would be a bonus. Any extra autographs. Any extra parallels. I think we've got our, our number of parallels that were listed at least. I don't like these either. I don't like having to, to deal with these little things. But I think we've hit our... our uh, our numbers on parallels and autographs. So any extra parallels or autographs should be in addition to what we, we already saw. And look, there we go. Right off the bat, another autograph, Travis Sikora. Jackson Churio, a dual Drew Thorpe, Robbie Snelling, and Wahiwa Aloy again. That one's for Washington. Who got Washington? Way down there at the bottom. Oh, that's me again. <laughs> oh, man. Well, what we're really waiting for is the ball anyway. To me. To me, this uh, autograph baseball has huge names. And the, the names are not just these young prospects, uh, young players, stuff like that. The names on the, uh, the baseball. Big names. Hall of Famers, current players. Um, again, prospects and stuff, but the ball, the ball can have anything. All right. Blake Mitchell, again, another one, another hot box. We're getting Wahiwa Aloy. 
Reminds me of the Maui Ahuna that I pulled when I was on vacation. I actually I don't think I've posted any of those yet. Just because ever since I've come back from vacation, I've still been busy. But, yeah, my wife pulled a Maui Ahuna out of a, uh, a Bowman Mega Box. Wahiwa Aloy. I'm guessing he's a uh, Hawaiian also. Yep. Waialuku, Hawaii. Very cool. Nice to see some some Hawaiians getting some representation in MLB. Put that one there. No numbered autographs, though. That's a little bit of a bummer, but it is what it is. Okay, we got Drew Thorpe, a dual Churio again, and McDonald. I gotta tell you, I hate these packs. The packs are not, not cool, but... The good thing is they do give you the bonuses, like two extra autographs so far. Brock Wilkin. Ooh, a, a yellow Yoshinobu Yamamoto out of 150. That's pretty cool. There's a Corbin Carroll. Uh, Thorpe and Snelling again. And Rhett Louder. Miscut all to hell. Gotta give it like a double rip. All right, I think we're done with our autos, but who knows? We'll see. Wahiwa Aloy. There's a nice Rhett Louder out of 150. It'd be nice to get something lower than out of 99. Everything that we've got has been a blue out of 99 or a yellow out of 150. Zach Cole, Robert Gasser, and Trevor McDonald again. Gasser, I believe, is uh, making his way up through the system. Matt Shaw, again, the Cubs too. Cubs were another team that was kind of flying under the radar. Alfredo Duno out of 150. Leo DeVries, Josh Hartle, and Dylan Lesko. Two more Padres in that group. The Mega boxes, the, the Mega Series boxes that we're going to open up next also has some exclusive uh, cards also. Blake Mitchell, Carson Williams, Blake Mitchell out of 150. Emmanuel Rodriguez, Harry Ford, and Jason Oliver. All right, last pack for our base series. Let's hope for hope for something nice. We do got a gold. At least there's that. Kaner Delgado. Gold is Blake Mitchell and Rhett Louder out of 150. I'm calling it gold, but that's being uh, generous. Zach Cole, Robert Gasser, and Trevor McDonald. And that finishes off the base box. Next up, Mega Box. All right, let's see. Again, no wrapping, just an empty kind of thing this is all there is just that one little sticker which is i don't know i think i think that they got to do better people complain about tops a lot complain about everything <laughs> that's pretty much it people complain about everything but i think this is actually uh this is actually warranted cuz it's I don't know. Maybe uh, maybe we're just spoiled because we do have tops and, you know, say what you will. Their quality control is better than others. Let's just say that. All right, so we've got five autographs, a minimum of five autographs coming up in here. And um, also more parallels, more cards per pack. And uh, other things that are exclusive to this mega box. So Jefferson Caro, Caden Dana, River Ryan. That would be a nice autograph to get. A dual Matt Shaw, Cade Horton. And it looks like we have an orange. So this is different as far as our duels go. Oh, and there's an autograph too. Drew Thorpe, Robbie Snelling. I think I know who this autograph is too. That's pretty cool. Is it Corbin Carroll? Very cool. Corbin Carroll autograph. And this one's out of 75. Again, not numbered. 
but a uh, out of 75 duel with a Corbin Carroll autograph. And I believe that's PHX, isn't it? Yeah, PHX. Very cool. Congratulations. Always nice to pick up a Corbin Carroll autograph, even if it is on a different, uh, a different company, different everything. Very nice, though. I like it. Like I said, not the most Corbin Carroll looking of Corbin Carroll cards. But definitely the best one we've got so far. Leo DeVries, La Voliette, Sakura, Lama Vida, and another Snelling Thorpe duel. We got doubles, triples, quadruples. This has got to be a really small set. And I got to tell you, if Onyx was trying to expand and kind of make their, their set bigger, more well known, they did not do it right. The quality control is not good. And, uh, yeah, the set is just too small to be getting all these doubles and triples after only, you know, one one small box, the base box, and now starting off on this one. Too many doubles, too many triples. Hartle, Jackson, Ford, Williams, Jimenez, Emmanuel Rodriguez for Minnesota. Minnesota is me again. <laughs> All base autos so far also. I mean, the, the autographs, they do have numbered autos. But none yet. All right, I'm just going to put this one off to the side. Jorge Marcheco, Stevenson, Jet Williams, and another Yamamoto. Three Yamamotos. I've been counting those. Yeah, these packs... They're difficult. They're different. All right, we got a green. This is something different. Way back there. Chase Burns, Emmanuel Rodriguez, a dual Carol Troy, Bryce Rayner, Robert Gasser. All right. Caleb Loma Vida. There's a nice looking auto. Good looking auto for a prospect. So that's three autos so far. Less than halfway through the box. So hopefully we got some extras in here too. Matt Ager, prospect, green out of 50. Again, not no individual number, just says out of 50, which in the past, in other sets... Um, there's another Ager, Aloy, Suspedes. First uh, Suspedes we've seen, and Montgomery. But in the past, the different colored ink that they've used on autographs is what differentiates the uh, the numbered cards. I, I use quotations, numbered cards, because in the past, they weren't numbered at all. It just said blue autos are out of 400, red autos are out of 50, or whatever it was. But, um, yeah, these ones are stamped, but they don't have the individual numbers. Wikoman Gonzalez, Blake Mitchell, Frosso, Zach Cole. Oh! There's the big one. Freddie Freeman. I believe the one, the one single, only current. Oh, no, wait. We got Corbin Carroll, too. But one of the few, one of the very few current players and i would say we got the two best ones i believe yamamoto actually signed in here too so maybe yamamoto but again with an incomplete chess checklist hard to tell <coughs> wow there we go very happy i mean i wanted that dodger spot but at the last minute my buddy Blue Thunderstars came in and stole my Dodgers spot. So congratulations to him. That, very nice. Tristan Peters. There's an Ethan Holiday. I'll put him over there. Jason Oliver, Robbie Snelling, and Jefferson Caro. Wow, Freddie Freeman. I was not expecting that. I could only be hopeful for it. But wow, what a, what a pull. That's a cool card. 
And Freddy, I, I'm not the biggest Freddy Freeman fan. If I'm being perfectly honest, not the biggest Freddie Freeman fan, but he has a really nice autograph and really big teeth. Dylan Lesko, Trevor Werner, Tristan Peters, Blake Mitchell. Hey, Harry Ford, another one. And look at, check this out. A nice Jesus loves you inscription on the Harry Ford. Very cool. Who got that? That's a uh, potato chip. Very cool inscription. Harry Ford with a Jesus Loves You inscription. All right. Well, the Mega Box is definitely coming through better than that Base Series Box did. That's nice. Very cool. All right, we got Jason Oliver, Leo Jimenez, Suspedes, Jack Centurio, and a base Corbin Carroll to finish those off. Well, all right. The last three autographs have, have got me pumped up. The first seven or eight, not so much, but the last three, very cool. Brock Wilkin, Tommy Troy, Mason Montgomery, Jason Oliver, Sammy Basayo, and we've got a black coming up, a black parallel. Leo DeVries, there's a big name. Very cool, Leo DeVries. We've got a black. I don't know what these ones are numbered out of. Matt Ager. I'll check that out in a second. But hey, my man Christian, you just joined in. Very cool. Guess what you just got, my friend? Toaster, good to see you as well. But check this out. The last four autographs. Let me give you guys a wave real quick. But yeah, the last four autographs, we got Leo DeVries here. One of the big name prospects in this set. We just pulled a Harry Ford inscription with Jesus Loves You on the bottom. Harry Ford telling you that jesus loves you there's the big one freddie freeman check that out blue thunder freddie freeman and right before that corbin carroll so yeah our second box the mega box has done us very good and we've got this black parallel i don't know what this one's numbered out of it is out of five wow and look at that that one actually has the serial number. Two out of five, Matt Ager. Two out of five, Matt Ager for the prospect spot. Not bad, Jared. That's a decent one. Two out of five. I didn't sleeve and top load immediately all of the, uh, all of the parallels. But a two out of five definitely deserves an immediate immediate uh top loading so that's cool we got josh hartle louder carol and festa david festa i think that's the first one that we've seen of him so all right not bad and we still got about half the box to go nice i'm glad you got that freddie freeman my man i would have loved it i would have loved if i got that spot but very cool. I actually have a Freddie Freeman auto, so I'm okay. Matt Shaw, Cade Horton, dual. Don't know why I put it in that stack. Jason Oliver. Looks like we have an orange. I think those are out of 75. Jason Oliver, Jacob Cozart, Dylan Lesko, Brady Breck. Do we have another auto? We do. And that is David Festa, one of the names that I said we haven't seen him before. So David Festa auto. Who is that for? Can't see the team name. Oh, Minnesota. I believe that was me, right? Yep. David Festa. Still no numbered auto. Drew Thorpe is our orange. I'm guessing it's orange out of 75. Tristan Peters. There's another duel, Cade Horton and Reggie Crawford. All right, we got about 
three packs. We got three packs to go. So after this, I will uh, do our mystery box that has two more autos in it. So I'll do our mystery box. Then we'll do our giveaway. And then the last thing we'll do is going to be the baseball. So we only got a couple people in here, but go ahead and throw out your numbers if you're ready. Four, two, or zero for our giveaway. Let's bring these ones forward. All right. Kaner Delgado, there's a Carol and Troy duel, Aloy, Jackson Churio, Drew Thorpe, Jason Churio, Carson Williams, David Festa, Robert Gasser. And this is different. I think this is not a orange. Wow, red ink, Drew Thorpe. Very cool. Red ink, Drew Thorpe out of 25, 8 of 25. All right. Well, we did get a numbered auto at least. Drew Thorpe. Red ink. All right. Well, okay. I may have to adjust my my little mini review a little bit. Because it seems to me that the hits are pretty nice. The hits are nice. The base cards are really not that great numbers are just to uh to say to kind of indicate their rarity i guess you could say so this color whatever this is i don't know if you would call this red or what it's still miscut definitely miscut so, uh left to right but yeah i don't know if this is red or what but eight out of 25 with red ink yeah san diego that's what i said kind of the sleepers over here let's get rid of alloy and we'll put that thorpe up there Yeah, I mean, it was it it's hard to price something like this especially with an incomplete checklist. But yeah, San Diego, I I I they were one of the pricier teams because they just had there's a lot. There's a lot of people for San Diego. I mean, look at there's Drew Thorpe, there's another Drew Thorpe. I don't think you guys can see it there. And another Drew Thorpe, so yeah, a lot of San Diego. Jefferson Caro, Hartle, Dana, Basayo, River Ryan, Chase Burns, Cade Horton, Wickelman Gonzalez, Leo Jimenez. And this would be nice if we had another auto here. Oh, nice. We do. Robert Gasser, green auto. Man, I don't know how these packs seems like. Uh, seems like they're all together. And look at that one. What did I tell you? I've seen hand numbered ones and that one's hand numbered 21 out of 50. So there's hand numbered um, cards. There's no numbered cards. And there's stamped cards. So the inconsistencies in full view here. But yeah, there's Milwaukee. That's not bad for Frank. Out of 50. 21 out of 50. Green auto. Let's move. Uh, we'll move the DeVries and put Gasser up there. All right. Last pack here. Maybe one more. Let's hope for one more. One more. Oh, not going to happen. Okay, Trevor Werner, Jason Oliver, Cozart, Caro, Jimenez. Oh, we do have another one. An another base auto, Matt Shaw. Not bad. Another one of the teams I said, Sleepers, Matt Shaw, Cubs. I wish I had the little paper that I used to, uh, to kind of give rankings to where the teams stand because Cubs were up there. That's a nice one. Let's move uh, this guy and put Matt Shaw up there. Can't see him anyways, but wow, we have a ton of autos. We were supposed to get 10, no, 9. I think 9 out of these boxes. There's Charlie Condone. That's the big one too. Missed out on him. Jason and Jackson Cheerio, Cade Horton, and Sammy Basayo. But yeah, <clears throat> let's see. Wow. I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, Five, six autos just here off to the side. 
Uh, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 autos. We were guaranteed 9, and we got 16 out of those two boxes. So, like I said, here's our mystery box, by the way. It's an older Onyx Vintage box. This is from 2021. Shohei is in here. Um, Bobby Witt is in here. Uh, who else? Um, Benny Montgomery was one of the big names in here. Uh, Robert Hassel, Harry Ford. There's quite a few uh, big names in here. Or medium names. Big slash medium names. But, uh, yeah. Man. You might kind of see, like, you know, the quality control is not all there, but they make up for it with the bonuses. Lots of extras. All right. Now, this pack, like I said, this is an older Onyx box. This is how it used to be for pretty much all of their sets. One pack that actually fits the cards. It's not oversized. But one pack with only four cards, two of which are autographs. So, if you're going to have a small set, this is the way to do it, in my opinion. Versus... Uh, Versus having a huge big set and getting doubles, triples, quadruples of all the players. So here we go. We got Gavin Cross. That's a prospect. This is Onyx Vintage Extended also. This is kind of like the update version, I guess, of, uh, of theirs. Because this year they also had regular Vintage, but now this is Vintage Extended. So Gavin Cross, that's our first prospect. Our first auto is for Toronto. Orelvis Martinez. Toronto, that's me. So Orelvis Martinez. I'll put him off to the side right now. Oh, there we go. Another Harry Ford. So Seattle, who was that? Bretato Chip. Two Harry Ford autographs. And our last one down here is a base Blaze Jordan. But two Harry Fords. Where did I put my other box? I had two boxes of top loaders here. Oh, there it is. Finished off one and moved on to the next. So two Harry Fords. Not bad. Not bad for Brettato Chip. All right, we'll do our giveaway next. So go ahead and throw out some numbers. Four, two, or zero. Which one do you guys want to see? Four, two, or zero. Or Elvis Martinez. PHX says four. All right, let's see four. Then we'll get into our baseball. Two packs. Two packs in number four. We got 2022 Tops Chrome. I think this is from a blaster. And 2022 Chronicles. Let's do the Chronicles. Stick with the uh, unlicensed stuff before we get to Tops Chrome. All right, we've got. Mookie Betts, Crusade, very cool. Don't think that's going to be numbered. It's not. It's just a, just a shiny card. Seiya Suzuki for Chicago, nice rookie. Is that uh, Brian Reynolds? Another nice shiny card. And Edward Cabrera. Out of Chronicles. Only four cards in there. Only four cards in here also. <clears throat> but we'll see what we can get. They got the typical Topps Chrome bend inside of them. We've got Eli Morgan. We do have a refractor. That's nice. You Darvish. We got Yadi Molina. And our refractor is... Houston, Alex Bregman. 
Look at that bend. It's like a bridge. Oh, man, I wish you guys could see. That is something. That is quite the bend. So, all right, that's that. Let's get some smoke going on because we got a big one coming up. The last thing we've got is our autograph baseball. So this is the big one. <clears throat> Definitely need some smoke here. And then afterwards, we'll go over all these autos because we got a lot. Close to 20 autos when only 12 were guaranteed. All right. All right, here we go. Like I said, huge names in here. I believe this comes in like a little a little velvet type bag or something. All right, is this our card? Let's put that over to the side. So real quick before we do this, some players like, for instance, um, Nolan Ryan, right? He's played for several different teams, is well known for several different teams. So... The way this will work is if we get a player like that that's been on multiple teams, um, in the end, it's my choice. You know, I make the final decision. But to be fair, what I'm going to do is, you know, go with the most recognizable team. If in the case of like Nolan Ryan, um, he's been on several recognizable teams, uh, I will, I'll randomize that. But for the most part, it'll be either the team they played for the longest where they're most recognizable or in the end, I'll just have to randomize it. If it's just kind of like, who knows? All right, let's see. Where's our auto autos on the back here. So we've got an official major league baseball Rawlings, all that brand new ball feels, feels great. All right. And let's go ahead and flip it over. Who's this? Uh, it's just uh, Onyx is the ones who uh, verified it. So, all right, here we go. It is Ed Howard. I kind of took a sneak peek. That's a nice looking autograph. Ed Howard. And the ball starts rolling. Ed Howard autograph baseball. And I cannot tell you right off the top of my head where that would go to. <laughs> but it is a nice looking auto. Ed Howard, not the name we were looking for. We were looking for like Willie Mays, Mickey Mantle, Aaron Judge, Yoshinobu Yamamoto, stuff like that. Well, we got Ed Howard. It is a nice looking ball. It is a nice looking auto. Just not the name we were looking for. Cubs prospect. Okay. Interesting. Hey, well, there you go. For PHX. Very cool. Let's slide this back here. And get our ball right on there. So there it is. All right. That does it. Let's kind of go over our autographs because we got a ton of them. These ones I had off to the side first. We've got... Oh, let me get this ball out of the way. It's just too much stuff. All right. Move the baseball over. Okay. Orelvis Martinez was our, our, our one of our last ones for Toronto. There's one of two Harry Fords, one of which has a Jesus Loves You inscription. So two Harry Fords... Travis Sikora, Leo DeVries, Wahiwa Aloy, David Festa, Caleb Lomavita, Emmanuel Rodriguez, lots of autos, Matt Ager, 
Trevor McDonald, Drew Thorpe. We've also got the red ink Drew Thorpe, so two Drew Thorpes there. We've got Bryce Rayner, Matt Shaw. Not bad. We've got the green Robert Gasser. We've got Freddie Freeman. We've got the out of five Matt Ager. Two out of five Matt Ager. And the last one, Corbin Carroll. So all together, we've got a giant stack of autographs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen autographs. Double what we were kind of guaranteed. Well, minus the two. So almost double uh, what we were guaranteed. So 18 autographs plus an autograph baseball. I don't know. I don't know how to how to say that about it, you know? I think it was cool. It was fun. The hits are hits, <clears throat> but the base cards are, uh, they leave something to be desired for sure. All right, here we go. Let's take a hit. Uh, this was the end of our first of two, two breaks today. So we got a double header coming up in just about 15 minutes or so. I'm just going to take a little break, go to the bathroom, maybe grab some food. And uh, we'll be back here in about 15 minutes and get right back into our second break, which is 12 boxes. 12 Blaster Boxes, the Fanatics exclusive for 2024 Series 2. All right, let's take one more hit, and uh, I'll see you guys all soon, hopefully. <laughs> 